Hello world, I'm Glocarp, welcome back to Inscription! Now first of all, I do need to apologize for not being videos for the last two weeks, that's because I got sick, I got hit with the big C, and even though my symptoms lasted for less than a week, or like the main symptoms, uh, my voice didn't really get back to normal until, well, yesterday, uh, so that's why there was uh, that uh, delay in the videos here, I couldn't do any recording. Now, I believe we are here at the snow line? And I don't think there's anything really for us to do. Well, we still need to do this. Uh, we get a, need to put a scroll and the coyote like that. Do we have gold teeth here? No? Okay, so yeah, I think that's the only thing we got here would be to do this. So let's see if we can get that to happen here uh, beyond uh, the snow line. Uh, what is our deck? I have forgotten. I think we have, yeah, we have a coyote. Of course, we have uh, the squirrels. Right, so do we have a piggy? We don't have a piggy, okay. Is there, okay, there's items there, so okay, so we'll go for this thing, and then we'll go for items. Uh, hoping to get a piggy, wait. I, okay, only have one item, though, so that's good. So what is this? The Trial of Blood. The three drawn cards must cost at least four blood. Alright, so this is a trial thing. So there's a trial of power, and uh, the trial of health. Okay, so let's see, what do our deck looks like? So, four blood. Seems like pretty easy. If we get two one bloods and one of the three bloods or two bloods, that should do it. Uh, so basically, for us to fail, we'd need to draw yeah, one of uh, these three cards. Okay, and power four. Uh, that also seems pretty doable. Yeah, because we need to three draw all. Well, two of these four cards. No way, that's four possible failures compared to just two possible failures and six health. Uh, that's actually the easiest one. Yeah, we only got two with one health. So if we th draw three any... If we don't draw these two cards, we're going to succeed in the health. So let's go for that. Let the trial of health begin. Okay, and yep. Two from the sting bug. Two from the amoeba, two from the wolf. You have passed. Okay, and what do we get? Oh, so we get... Wait, what are you? Mirror, the power and uh, equal the bearing. Okay, well, I don't know what this is. Let's take it. And see what it does. And yeah, we're going to have to go get some items and hope we get a piggy. Really, really hope we get a piggy here. That pitiful opossum. Okay, yeah, well, there's the piggy, and that's what we wanted, so we'll take the piggy. And... I don't think we need another piggy. Uh, let's take the flying thing. And yeah, we'll take the flying thing. Okay, and for a fight... Okay, so I think now... Oh, bloody hell, I should have gone and checked! So you found the standard wolf. I have seen this play out enough times to know that a plan is in motion. Make haste. You took the film roll. Is that correct? My plan nears its moment of truth, but you must defeat him first. Okay, now. I honestly don't remember uh, which way... Oh, we don't have the coyote in hand, of course. Well, that just means we're just gonna have to play. So what are you putting out? Uh, vulture and a mole. Okay, uh, what are we dealing here? Well, you two, two damage, you are immortal and a killer, so that's nice. Okay, well, we're gonna put the standard wolf down. Uh, you're a flyer, right? Yeah, so you attack over enemies, so I think we're gonna put the stunted wolf here, so that it will eventually, are you sure? Yes, I'm sure, eventually kill uh, the vulture. Okay. Okay, so the vulture is going to deal damage to us. That's fine. We're going to take a squirrel. Oh, we can't just sacrifice the squirrel for nothing. Right, that's a problem because I wanted to uh, sacrifice it to put the stink bug in play over here. Uh, but that's not going to happen. So I think we're going to have to take the black goat here. Or do we? Uh, that's a raven egg. So if we put this... Yeah, because we can't really... Well... We're gonna take three damage, one, two, three. 
And then... No, I think we can still... We can just play for now, I think. Yeah, because uh, he's gonna do three damage, damage to us. We're gonna hit... Oh, but then he's gonna do other three... No, no, can't do... Cannot do that. Yeah, we're gonna have to take the Black Goat. The Squirrel in. Sacrifice it for the Goat. Uh, put the Wolf in. Over... No, the wolf's gonna be flying. Wait, do flyers attack flyers? That's actually something I'm not 100% sure about. Well, we'll put the wolf here. Maybe we'll see. And we'll put the stink bug over here. Yep, we shall. Okay, so he's gonna be throwing three damage to us. That is fine. I'm gonna grab this just in case we get the coyote. Okay, great white. Uh, that doesn't really help us, but, uh, right, so we're gonna dealing four damage. Okay, we're not winning just yet, but we're not far from winning. Okay, oh, right. Well, that's not good. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna take this just hoping to get the coyote again. Okay, well, maybe we're gonna have to go for a squirrel next time. We got the alpha incoming. That's not good. Okay, let's see if the wolf kills the raven. Uh, are we winning, actually? I think we're winning, because we're doing 5 damage. Is there a way for us to deal more damage? The great white does 4 damage. Uh, we can't sacrifice enough. Okay, yeah, we're just gonna... I think we're just gonna win here. Yep, okay. That's fine. Now, do we want to go and grab some pelts, or do we want to go for another trial? I think we're going to go for another trial so that we can sacrifice one of our creatures to make other creatures better. We'll go for here. Okay, what are our... Okay, the trial of power. The trial of kin. Two of the three drawn cards must be kin to pass. The trial of bones. The three drawn cards must cost at least five bones combined to pass. Okay, so I'm... Guessing we don't really have good kinship going here. Uh, well, we have one, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six wolves. So if we get two of them, that would be fine. Uh, we're that's definitely not gonna win the bone thing because I don't think we even can. Yeah, we'd have to. Well, the coyote costs four bones, so maybe. Also, can I get? Okay, can't get out from right now, because I need to go check which way I had to put the coyote and the, and the squirrel. Uh, so this, we're gonna go for power. I think it's, yeah, we're gonna have to go for power. Let the trial of power begin. And... Yep, that's done. Right. One from the bullfrog, four from the great white, one from the mantis. Success. Okay, what do we got here? The kingfisher, that's a guardian. An opposing creature is placed, that doesn't really matter. Raven that can be sacrificed for more, or a flying mole. I mean, these are all just bad. Like, seriously, this is just bad. I'm gonna take the raven. Like, just in case. Okay, and now let's go check this out. Okay. So the coyote needs to be in the corner. Okay. Coyote in a corner. Okay, that's coyote corner. CC. Let's think about it like that. Maybe I'll we'll remember it. Okay, so who are we sacrificing? Maybe the amoeba? Sure, why not? Because it's... Oh, wait. I want the amoeba for the bone cost. So the bullfrog, I think, is what we're going to be sacrificing then. And who are we going to make better? I think uh, the stout. Making the stout better is probably the best idea here. It's just uh, basically making him into a better bullfrog. Yeah. Fine choice. Yep, 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 it was a fine choice. Okay, and now, come on, okay, give me the coyote in my beginning hand. No, there's a... a snowy fur there. Okay, another vulture, another mole, okay. So... Ooh! Ah, the vulture is gonna kill the stoat. That's not very good. Hmm. And it 
doesn't really matter where we put the stoat. Because it is going to be killed. Or, I mean, it's going to be blocked by the mole anyways, next turn. It's not going to be killed. But it would be killed if we put it here. Okay, now the problem that I see is we need to deal more than three. Well, we're going to have to put the wolf. Oh! Damnation! If I put the wolf in play, the mole's gonna block it. Uh, then it's gonna block to stoat. Yeah, and it's gonna die. And then we're gonna take three damage. And then we're gonna lose. Uh, that is not an option, really. So we're gonna have to take a squirrel. And we're gonna have to make our wolf fly. Oh, this is... this is very not good. Really should have... okay, well if I put the stout here, uh, we wouldn't, couldn't be able to put the wolf in play. But yeah, we need to make the wolf fly this turn. Yeah, <laughs> the fur is flying as well. Uh, that's fun. Okay, and now the vulture is going to deal damage to us, so the wolf is gonna grow, and we're gonna be we're gonna be getting three damage this. We just lost damnation! Oh, great draw! That is a great draw. That is like the perfect draw. Oh bloody hell! So we didn't lose. Okay. Ah, oh, that's what nice. That's nice. That's nice. So the mole's gonna block the wolf, but the stink bug is gonna kill the turkey vulture. So that's good. Oh, but now the raven is gonna come down and deal two damage. Okay. Uh, we have one of those. Okay, we're gonna have to take a squirrel here. So we're dealing four damage, killing that. Then he's dealing two damage. So yeah, we're at, gonna be at the plus two from this. No, the alpha's gonna come down. He's gonna be... De well, we're still gonna be at a better situation than we are right now. Let's see any reason to put the bloodhound... or the... Wait, 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 of course I see a reason to put the bloodhound down right now. Because, uh... Yeah, the stink bug is immoral. So we can just put it... If I'd been smart, I would've played the bloodhound here and the stink bug here. But, you know, sometimes, sometimes I am not smart. Okay, so the ravens can deal three. That's fine. Okay, let's see what we're getting next. The raven. Okay, that doesn't really help us at this point. But we're basically winning here already. Yeah, because I think next turn we're going to be winning. Yeah, okay. Oh, the amalgam. So, we could... Put... <laughs> oh, there's absolutely no reason. I was thinking that we could put down the raven and then sacrifice it to put down the amalgam, but we could just sacrifice these things to put down the amalgam. And then the thing... So, the amalgam does a little bit more damage. Yeah, okay, so yeah, that's a good idea. We'll just put it down. So we'll maybe do some extra damage, put the Stink Bug back in play, and we'll go for the win. Hey, Achievement Unlocked Squirrel Wrangler! What does that mean? Win a battle with damage from squirrels. I didn't do that though. Huh. Weird. Okay, well let's go and get another card. Oh, there's Uncle Carp! That is basically just a... Uh, what is it? Uh, the adder? Yeah, we'll take it though. Of course we're gonna take it. Okay, so we could go here for some warmth. Oh, oh, do we have doubles in our deck? We have two wolves. I wonder if uh, because they have different symbols, if they're considered to be a same. Cause this place here wants two of the same. No, let's go check it out. Let's go check it out. Like, we, do, we have no real reason to go through here. I mean, we make our creatures better. You came upon the old woodcarver who fixed her intense gaze upon you. After an overlong moment of silence, she moved to offer her carvings. Okay, so what do we get here? So we could... 
Ooh, we could get wolves. We have a lot of wolves, right? Yeah, there that's like our biggest thing. Yeah, yeah, we're gonna take the wolf head. And we're gonna make all of our wolves deadly. Or canines, canines, I think they're called. The grey haired woman silently collected her carvings and left. Right yo, for battle we go. Wait, wait, again. Okay, so what do we got coming? Moose buck. Ooh, that's powerful. Okay, so we want to be in a situation. So the moose buck moves, attacks here, moves here. So we want to put one of our killers over here so that it'll kill the. Uh, we can't. Oh, we can't. The stunted wolf. Is oh wait are we gonna die? No no we're not gonna die. Yeah, standard wolf is a killer. We'll put it here. Use me wisely. We will use you wisely. Yeah, that two damage in the moose bug is going to attack and then move. Yep, so we kill it next turn. Uh, the elk fawn is not gonna kill this guy, so that's good. And then we are going to grab our squirrel. And we are going to put... well, it doesn't really matter where we put the squirrel. And we're going to put the mantis in play over here. Uh, the reason we put it here is because it's going to turn into the mantis god. And I want it to have like three lines of attack open to it. Okay, so are we taking... we're not really any... okay, we're not taking any damage next turn, so that's fine. Okay, careful now. Yes, yeah, so the elk is going to kill the stunted wolf. Let's grab. Okay, there's another wolf here. Uh, I don't think. Wait, 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 wait. Oh, because the stunted wolf kills. Damn it! Uh, it's gonna kill the mole. Because I was thinking like the, the, the mole's gonna move here, and the, then we're gonna be protected from the elk. But that's not going to happen. So we're basically gonna lose one blood. That is really not something I want to happen, but... Wait, wait, wait! I think... no. <sighs> huh. Cause I'm thinking that maybe, because the man this guy's gonna attack here, maybe the mole man is gonna move here, and then the standard wolf's gonna kill that, but the mole is still isn't going to move yet, so the standard wolf is going to die. That's, that's just something that is going to happen, and we can't really do anything about that. Okay, the elk goes there. Okay, so the mantis god is going to die as well. Okay, well that means that we're gonna grab a squirrel, because the mantis god is going to be dying. Uh, we'd rather just put a wolf in play. We'll put this wolf, so it'll actually kill the elk. Okay, another elk incoming, but our wolf is going to be able to uh, stand that. Okay, so you are... Mirror... Okay, I'm guessing... Just guessing here. I don't remember uh, what this card actually does. I'm not sure if I ever figured out what it does. Uh, but I'm guessing because it's a mirror that it's going to mirror the power of the creature uh, opposing it. Oh, the elk's gonna move! Damn elk. Well, no, let's. Uh, do you have. You have three health. Okay, yeah. So we'll see if the mirror mirrors. Yeah, okay, yeah. Is it. <laughs> Makes uh, logical sense to me, at least. Okay, so the elk's gonna hit us, so now it's a zero cost, yeah. Uh, okay, we'll take a squirrel. We'll sacrifice the mirror creature and uh, put the wolf here. We're gonna be dealing seven damage and we're gonna be winning. We should probably go get ourselves a pelt. Oh, well, we're not going to be getting ourselves a pelt anymore. Actually, there's the boss fight, so let's uh, go for that. Okay. Uh, well, I honestly don't want any of these. What? We'll take an insect. A worker ant. Ah, a diligent ant. Its strength is proportionate to the size of its colony. Yep. Gonna have to grab that, and then we'll go for the mushroom people. You found yourself among a grove of thick and pungent mushrooms. You squinted to see a figure through a thick cloud of spores. We are the mycologists, yes? Yes. Uh, uh, and we are performing our experiments far from, from... We are not welcome elsewhere. 
We will experiment on your flock, yes? We will need two of the same creatures. One for each of us. So, yeah, okay, we got wolves. So let's see, are we gonna get a wolf with three symbols? So that would be... I, I, I think this could get messy. Look away. The, the wolf! It, it, it's not one. Okay, so a wolf is now pretty interesting. So it's gonna turn into a, what? A, a seven six? That's pretty good. You took in the familiar sight and sense of the trapper's pelts. But something was different. The once friendly man now beheld you with a steely gaze. Oh, I'm, I'm afraid I must be skidding you today. Okay, so you got the tra a lucky drop. So you got the trap things, right? Yeah, leaping traps, strange frogs. Okay, 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 okay. What can we do here? So we can sacrifice you two to put... Yeah, we can put the raven in play. Uh, we probably want it to be on this line so we can actually deal damage. And we can put the stink bug... Hmm, okay, 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 well... Yep, smoke in play, squirrel in play, raven in play, and the stink bug in play as well. And let, let's see what this gives us. Okay, not a very good situation. Uh, if I kill the leaping trap... Does it just go away? Do I have a line there? Because now the raven is going to attack the strange frog here. And if I remember things correctly, the strange frog is actually a trap. And it's going to kill us. Okay, no, no, no. I, I did not remember correctly. So it's the trap that's going to kill us. Oh, we got a pelt for that. Okay. That looks... Oh, the wolf! Uh, the wolf is attacking for six, so if we sacrifice the raven here for the wolf, the wolf is going to be killing. So we'll just, <laughs> we'll just wait in there. Uh, the stink bug is going to die, that doesn't really matter, because it's going to come back into her hand. There's also another pelt. Uh, Excruciate pelt, uh, but the cycle must continue. Let's trade. Okay, we got ourselves another wolf pelt. Powerful cards. I accept only the finest pelts for them. Okay, so we got two pelts. I think we can get two cards, is what that means. Uh, can we grab the grizzly? Trade for what you can, but know this the rest will stay and fight for me. Yes, okay, I think we're gonna grab the grizzly then for sure. And. Now this is the bell ringer, okay, so it doesn't really matter that it's opposing. Oh, we're just gonna win with the wolf, so it doesn't really matter at all. Yeah, I'm gonna grab the great white and the wolf as well. I would have chosen differently. Okay, yeah, but the elder wolf is just gonna smash everything, so it doesn't really matter. Let's see if we can play anything. Uh, nope, so we're just gonna play the stink bug. Uh, over here. And then we're gonna win. Yeah, okay, that was... Reignite! Perhaps one of these will entice you. Okay, come on, give me the... Give me the Ouroboros, give me the Ouroboros! No, just another amalgam. I'll take the child 13 for the immortality thing. 
With the enigmatic tracker and traitor now bleeding, says no, you persisted. You can see a light in the distance. The end is near. So let's uh, go for the end then. A moment. Yeah, because this is pretty fast. Oh, I don't remember what this is. This is the one where we trade pelts for stuff. We don't have any pelts, okay? So let's go for sacrifice. Sacrifice. What are we gonna sacrifice? We're gonna sacrifice Angle Carp, I think. To get that lethality to someone that it's better on. I am at your service. Uh, who do we want to make lethal? Hmm. Probably... The coyote? Okay, and then let's head for the final thing. Your eyes affix themselves on the small cabin. It's warm light, a beacon in the oppressive darkness of the night. Surely, surely this cabin marked the end of your travails. Ooh! Crap! What was that? <laughs> okay. Steps away from the strange cabin, you are presented with an opportunity. I don't offer my board to just any traveler. If you're able to pass my trials, you will be rewarded mightily. The trial of rarity, the three drawn cards must include a rare card. The trial of the swift, the three drawn cards must include a card with the sprinter's sigil. The trial of the wing, the three drawn cards must include a card with the airborne sigil. Okay, so let's... I can't look at my deck now! Oh bloody hell! Ah. Uh... Wait, what's that? It says 11. Did I accidentally get 11 at some point? I think I actually got 11 at some point, right, didn't I? <laughs> and I opened the thing. So we don't have any sprinters, that I know for sure. We have a couple of flyers. Do we have rare cards? We have the Child 13, we have the Amalgam. Uh, do we have anything other that's rare? Do we have, maybe we have more flyers than... Uh, we have a Flying Wolf, we have the Raven. Uh, I think we only have two. We must have three rare cards, right? Because we've beaten three bosses and we've gotten three cards. So let's go for a rare. Let the trial of rarity begin. Nope, should have gone for pliers. Mm, not a single rare card. Failure. We will repeat that once more. The trial of the ring. If you have a ring, you pass automatically. The trial of the fin. The three drawn cards must include a card with the waterborne sigil. The trial of skins. The three drawn cards must include a pelt card. We got the ring, right? Maybe that's what we got at 11 o'clock. But we got the ring from the clock. So, this should do it. Let the trial of the ring begin. Oh, you are a, wearing a fine ring. You pass, of course. Yeah, okay, good. I will grant you one of my most powerful boons. Cards that dramatically alter the game. And you don't even need to draw them. Okay. The boon of the bone lord. You will start a battle with eight bones. Don't really need that. The boon of the magpie's eye. When you draw from your deck, you may choose any card in your deck to draw. Yeah, we're gonna take that. Like, I can't see anything being better than that. The boon of the forest. You will start a battle with grand furs on all of your spaces. Yeah, yeah, we're gonna just take the magpie's eye. Like, cause that's the, I, like in any card game where you're drawing cards, being able to pick the card you draw is like the most powerful effect there can be. Also, there's nothing on the sign, so we can look around, but there is no, nowhere else to go but forwards. <gasps> you managed to get a boon. This may be a fair competition. Oh, I need to keep moving. I was just like, what's happening? Okay, what's happening now? It's just like, oh, something's happening now. <gasps> you took your time to out there, and I'm itching for another game. Are you ready to play? Yes, I am ready to play. I hope you are adequately prepared. 
Well, let's see what our fight is going to be like. Perhaps one more to be safe. Damn cheater. Ooh, the amoeba. Oh, it's gonna grow. And we get the stink bug, so that's nice because we have the piggy bones here. So let's just grab the piggy bones. Get the stink bug in play. And uh, the amoeba as well. So you're dealing three damage. Do I mind getting three damage in? I mean, probably not. So let's put the amoeba in there, and let's put the stout in as well. Bang. And we'll see what's gonna happen. So yeah, this thing's gonna... Wait, why did it die? Oh, because the stink bug isn't deadly anymore! Crap pity! I forgot that it's my wolves that are deadly now, and not my insects. Okay, so what do we want to draw? this thing. I'm guessing it's this thing that we want to draw. Or something that will actually kill the amalgam. So... The coyote? Do we still have four bones? Oh, no. We don't have enough bones. Uh, this is the mirror. Oh, the mirror dude will also kill him. So if we... No, but we need to... S oh, well, we can sacrifice the sting bug. Right. Get... I was supposed to get the mirror, dude, but, uh... Okay, the amalgam works fine. I was, th I was thinking, like, we're gonna kill the amalgam. That's why it was, uh... We're gonna have to put the greater smoke in play and sacrifice that as well, which is kind of unfortunate, but hey, that's just the way it's gonna go. I uh, don't think I want to put the stink bug in right now. So the Mantis God is gonna come, it's gonna hit the Elder Amoeba, but the Elder Amoeba is gonna kill it next turn. Yeah, yeah. I don't want to put the stink bug in play just now. Because... Uh, what it'll do, it'll only kill the mole man. We'll get one damage in. I'd rather keep the stink... You know what? No, no. We're going to put it in play. I was thinking that I, I want to keep it as an option to actually deal... Like, to help at some point. Like, <laughs> damn it. <laughs> if something weird... Okay. Okay, so... Right, he did that thing. Well, uh... Okay, so the Amalgams are gonna kill the Gold Nuggets. We're gonna be needing to be killing them. Uh, if we put the Stink Bug... Oh, wait, what's gonna happen next turn is we're gonna be getting three damage in. One, two... Is that gonna kill us? I think we're... dead. Damn it! Because we can't get rid of the gold nuggets. So... Doesn't matter what... Okay, I'm gonna get, grab the coyote. Just because, you know, it's deadly. But we can't put anything in. And what's gonna happen is uh, the... Mantis guy is gonna kill these gold nuggets. The amalgam is gonna come down. It's gonna hit us for three. And we're gonna be dead. That's unfortunate. There's nothing... Warstale, hard shoes. Oh, you gonna... Yeah, now we're dead, aren't we? Yeah. That was super unfortunate. You made it so far. I was really, really hoping to actually finish this right there, but hey, sometimes... Sometimes life just doesn't go your way. Please, try to mill an for just a short while longer. I would like a memento. Okay, you can have a death card. So, cost, uh, we'll take one blood as the cost. And power and health. Well, we're gonna grab them for <laughs> this wolf. And sigils. Well, probably this thing, then. I think grab the Mance's sigils. Yeah, that's a good card. This is powerful. 
Prepare yourself. Death awaits. Are you ready? Ah. Well, that means that next time we are going to have to go through all of these guys again. So close, that last one. I doubt you'll make it as far. Well, I'm going to make it as far. I have the roll. What are you looking at? Keep your eyes on me. The foul stunted wolf. You really want such a creature in your deck? The sight of it does try my temper. But it has been dealt. So it stands. Okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, let's look around the room if anything has changed. Okay, so now we want... You're wondering about that painting? I've seen stuff come out of it. But only if the cards are aligned just right. Yes, I was... Like, it was clear from the thing that that's what needed here. Uh, okay, we got gold here. We got some mushrooms here. Do nothing. You got anything new to say? Oh, defeat him once more! That should do it! He has no idea what you have up your sleeve! Okay, okay, okay. And, yeah, we saw the 11, but I'm pretty sure that's what opened the... Uh, Opened something earlier for us. Yeah, pretty sure about that. Okay, but hey, uh, oh! But yeah, uh, I think that's gonna be it for now, and we're gonna continue with this in the next episode. I'm Gokarp, this has been Inscription. Goodbye, world. Thanks for watching. See you next time! <laughs>